Hey everybody, Ryan Mayer here. Another quick devotional in my car. Today I want to talk to you about your effectiveness for the Lord and put a little bit of, I don't know, um, fuel behind your fire in the sense that, you know, we only have so much time on this planet. It's almost like an hourglass where, you know, you turn the hourglass over and you can see the sand running out and that's kind of like our lives, really. Um, you only have so much time. And so I want to encourage you that you're either going to die or Jesus is going to come back. And so we only have so much time. And we are called to be co-workers, co-laborers. The, the word is co-labor. To labor is to work. So we are part of the body of Christ. God needs us to work and to do the things he wants us to do, to do his will on earth, right? So I want to encourage you to do that. And so I was thinking about this. How can we be more effective for the Lord? Well, if we're not doing a few things like uh, staying healthy, drinking water, um, getting enough sleep, then we're, we're going to be a lot less apt to be able to be focused and accomplish God's will on this planet. So, uh, the number one thing I want to say to you is get enough sleep. Get enough sleep. If you're not getting seven or eight hours of sleep, then it's it's probably much more difficult for you to not be grumpy or not you know being you know, just in a bad mood all the time. How can you shine as a light in this world if you are constantly tired and you don't you're, you're just grumpy all the time? So get enough sleep. I'm talking to myself as well. I constantly battle with, you know, uh, trying to get enough sleep. But if you think about it, the reasons why we don't get enough sleep is you don't go to sleep when you're supposed to. A lot of times that's probably because you're watching Netflix or you're on the internet or you're on your phone or whatever, and it's just wasted time. So you could just set an alarm that's like literally bedtime to say get in bed and make sure you go to bed on time and so that you can get up at the right time and maybe have a quiet time in the morning and you'll be even that much um, more of a blessing to be around because you've gotten centered with the Lord. So go to bed on time. The second thing that I wanted to mention is drink enough water. You know, 80 to 100 um, ounces of water a day for most people, if not more. How many people actually drink that much water? Probably not you, and a lot of times not me. And I'm not coming down on you, I'm just saying we need to drink more water because our bodies are made of water. And I don't know if you know this, but the number one cause for daytime dehydration, so you know, in the middle of the day, if you're falling asleep at work or school or, or whatever, and you're dozing off, and you're like super groggy, it's because you haven't drank enough water. It's uh look it up. It's, it's true. So, um, <laughs> I just want to encourage you guys drink water and, and keep a water bottle like this. I actually use this, uh, smart water, uh, bottle. It's this, uh, tall skinny one because it fits in my cup holder and it can fit in my bag that I usually have with me wherever I go. It's like a, a book bag that has my laptop and all that kind of stuff in it and just keep it with you and you'll have water with you wherever you go. So, and then actively proactively drink water. I use a, uh, an app on my watch and on my phone uh, called Water Minder. Search the app store for that. It might be on Google Play, I'm not sure, but they probably have something similar if, uh, if they don't have that exact one. But it reminds me to drink water. Um, and it, it's sad that we need so many reminders in our lives, but we do. Uh, there's so much going on, we're always so busy and stuff like that. But I wanna encourage you to get enough sleep and drink enough water because that alone if you're more alert, more just energized, and you know, say you're eating the right food too, that could be a third one, uh, working out, that could be a fourth one, then you could be more effective for the Lord because you're not falling asleep. And I know this is very basic common sense type stuff, but I believe that this is probably an encouragement that some of you need because I need it on a regular basis. So I wanted to share it with you too. So hopefully this has been a blessing and uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and share this on Facebook, Instagram. Um, I don't know how you would do that unless you upload it to Instagram, but I appreciate your guys' uh, support, and uh, thanks so much. God bless you guys. See you in the next video. Drink water. Peace.